the world has become zoomified. Here and around the world, we're seeing no end to the innovative ways people are finding to get together while still staying apart. Overall, this thing is not just a health crisis, but in some ways, it's continuing to become a, a relationship crisis for a lot of couples. Look into my eyes. And describe, what do you see? Oh, man. Um, Let me see your eyes. I know that when you look into my eyes, all you see is shit brown and ugly because you have told me. You are so full of it. You have told me. I, I have brown eyes too. Like, so you right. can't even say this. A bad bitch, you know? You, you, look <laughs> <laughs> you know how um, people say that when you spend more time with like your pets, you start to look like them? <laughs> yeah. I don't know if you're giving me your beautiful little puppy's eyes right now, just like full of this pure love. I see happiness. A lot of hope. A very strong person. I see ambition. Someone who's brave. The father of my children. Sharp glimmer. It's not even dim. Dim is like the opposite of what I see. A lot more than the man I married. Love and compassion i just love you so much so i don't know like I, I i do stare at you a lot because it's just one of those it's like look at my person like you really try you know and it's like not just trying it. like with work but just you as a person like you try in like every essence of who you are i just see my entire existence <sighs> For me, Zoom and these video calls will always feel so strange and nostalgic because this is how I got to see you for the first time. And I was like in two seconds, my whole world imploded. That's how it felt like when I logged on and got to like actually see you as this real person. My, I was like, oh, all right, yeah. <laughs> just the end.